ओहो ओहो पहला नशा इनका गाना था स्टेज पे मैं परफॉर्म करती थी आमिर के साथ वाले एंड ऑडियंस आल्सो वुड बी कंफ्यूज कि इनका है इनका है बस अच्छा गाना है और अच्छा कोई डांस वांस चल रहा है आमिर के साथ वी इन द 90s पीपल नो इट बट वी हैव सीन इट आल्सो इज ऑन द सेट देयर वुड बी लाइक अ यूनिट ऑफ 100 पीपल शूटिंग पे So there were only two or three women. One was you, one was your hairdresser, and maybe one mom or an aunt yeah. which came along. The rest were all men. My big moment was when I saw a crane going up at the shoot, and over there sitting up there on the crane was not normally a man. Uh, behind the camera, it was a woman, a, a young thirty-year-old or something. Oh. I was like, wow, we have arrived. <laughs> I love to see what women are doing. I love to watch women. Does that happen with men too? Do they really love watching women centric stuff? Hello and welcome to News 18 Shosha. My name is Sonal Dedia and today we have the team of Hashash out here with us. Hello everyone. Hello. Hi. I really want to do this. And hmm? please excuse me. <laughs> आई ला जुई चावला अरे ओके आई ला आई ला आई ला या या सो टेल अस प्रेज योर हैंड इफ यू हैव बीन अ जुई चावला फैन अरे वी ऑल हैव बीन व्हाट इज दिस ये क्या हो रहा है यहां पे हमारा अच्छा मतलब तुम मेरी बात कर रहे हो आई जस्ट वांट टू टेल यू कि पहला नशा इनका गाना था स्टेज पे मैं परफॉर्म करती थी आमिर के साथ प्रिटेंडिंग इज माइंड एंड एंड ऑडियंस आल्सो वुड बी कंफ्यूज कि इनका है इनका है अच्छा गाना है और अच्छा कोई डांस वांस चल रहा है आमिर के साथ इज दैट अ रेवोल्यूशन फॉर यू ऑफ कोर्स इट इज राइट आई मीन वी स्पोक अबाउट सो मेनी थिंग्स बट या दिस वाज इट्स वंडरफुल राइट टेल अस दिस यू नो तनुजा हाउ इंस्ट्रूमेंटल वाज इट टू कास्ट Aisha and Juhi both, apart from the fact that we have some powerful performers, uh, Shana, Soha, Kritika, Karishma, uh, was it that you wanted these two to be a part of Ashash? You know, it, now that you put it that way, it wasn't some kind of uh, strategy mm. at all. Mm. Uh, because actually, I don't operate like that. I mean, for me, it's always that who's the actor that I love for this role, who's the actor mm. I'm really, really dying to work with. Right. So both of them actually, in that sense, were independent of the image of the two of them together. Only after I had already approached and met, and 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 uh, you know, Juhi was the first actor, in fact, that I approached for this series. um and even after speaking to aisha and after i felt that it would be that both of them would be a part of it i was ecstatic and really happy and only later did it strike me that oh yeah these two together are like just such a juicy and lovely and amazing thing yeah. <laughs> and it strikes me more now yeah. and also of course seeing them together uh, on screen was it's, it's just a beautiful feeling but essentially because i think each of them is like a wonderful actor mm. and that's the reason i uh, went to them but uh, you all never got a chance to work back uh, during your you know the 90s if i may say yes. so very strange yes, strange yes, yes. uh, never got a car uh, i'm assuming you all had some screen time if i may say so i don't know if there is a little bit of it what was the in, whole vibe uh, in hashash, in hashash? hashash? Together, yes yes what what was the whole vibe like you know were they were the memories that that you all shared or the you know the days back when you got on this nostalgic How was it like? See, we were nostalgic, but we didn't have memories with each other because we didn't work together. Yeah. But then we used to talk about, you know, those times, and and she would always say, "Ki isn't it strange? हमने काम नहीं किया है साथ में." So yeah. yeah, I mean, we had fun. It was nice. It was lovely, actually. I just uh, have to jump in and say this: that uh, one, just to know that I was going to be meeting her, because for a while, even I hadn't seen her on screen. but of course through the 90s and the early 2000s we both were doing films and strangely had never even met nahi to socially yeah socially ya kabhi set pe mil gaye ho aisa hua hi nahi tha or we are shooting in the same studio how yeah. do you meet otherwise yeah. strange mm. right. and then we met and we met actually at a show for television and we were like you know what now we're going to be working together in harshash <laughs> and it was lovely we hit it off i think we hit yeah, it off we very well and we enjoyed yeah. ourselves yeah. at shooting together so there's a dialogue in hashash uh, which uh, juiji says uh, it says that aurton ko 
यू नो डराने का जिम्मा सिर्फ मर्दों का होता है हैव यू ऑल एवर फेस दीज सिचुएशन वेर यू नो वेर यू यू हैव बीन टोल्ड नॉट टू बी ओपिनियनेटेड और नॉट टू वॉइस आउट और यू नो प्रॉब्लली इन द इंडस्ट्री और अदरवाइज आई मीन बिकॉज दिस इज अ वेरी पावरफुल डायलॉग विच विच कम्स आउट Oh ho oh ho <laughs> I mean uh, I, let me start because yeah. uh, uh, I do think that yes there is even if you are not uh, asked to muzzle your voice you somehow tend to do it because uh, you might anticipate that it will not be acceptable to say this or it's it's uh, it's being opinionated um I've tried of course through my life and in my career put that voice out there uh one can't always do it but i want to hope for that world where one can always do it you mm. know and 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 have one's voice out there mm. uh that's my hope for the future right see i i i have experienced it okay and i have no qualms in saying that a lot of times you know you you really try hard to be the good one and you know no trouble making everything but the world doesn't let you be hmm. you know and whether it's the industry because industry is our world and uh, there have been number of times when you know um, even if it's not directly said indirectly done or said there are times when you know it's always uh, somebody who's trying to pin you down or trying to uh, remove you from a particular place or anything turns out to be a man so it's because we have so many men ruling the industry but that does not make them bad human beings or women better or good it's just the way it works and probably now that if more women are taking over and if there is more equality probably we'll also do something like this we don't know reji uh i was just thinking back so i'll just say two little things um ke probably in the 90s and people know it but we've seen it also is on the set there would be like a unit of 100 people shooting pe so there were only two or three women yeah. one was you one was your hairdresser and maybe one mom or an aunt yeah. which came along mm. the rest were all men mm. so whatever it is you know that we hota hai it is all men today it's all changed mm-hmm. you have 50% are all women on the yeah. sets uh, that's fabulous uh, the other thing i'll just come to hashash just playing this role of ishi and uh, you know having the freedom to interact with tanuja about it matlab maine inko tang kar dala scenes jab aaye i wanted to know every dot any every comma every full stop ki bhai ye kyu hai ye aisa kyu bol rahe hain hum iska mera mera matlab kya hai because i wanted to understand ishi because it's a very complicated character <laughs> it's very different from me in real life so i don't know and one she is really lovely main unke samne unki tareef kar rahi hu cash bhej dena acha wo haste haste unhone mujhe sab kuch samjhaya hai aur bahut achhi tarah se mere se matlab she was very uh, patient and welcoming of any discussion i don't know if i would have done that with a male director mm. with the same ease mm. the same thing ki nahi mere ko batao I felt that comfort yeah. just mm-hmm. working with you. Mm-hmm. So that that exactly was my next question considering what Aisha ji and you both mentioned that it's it's predominantly a male uh, you know industry. You know uh, how has the ambience kind of changed today? I mean because <laughs> like you said you know there would be hardly two or three probably <laughs> yeah. a, you would also call a makeup dada. Yeah, you know? yeah 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 yeah. So you know how has the ambience changed and how does it feel how does it make you feel more comfortable or more accepting? it has changed now we have uh, women who are doing our makeup mm. you know so that itself we could not even imagine that you know that day would come when this we could do without uh, you know our makeup man yeah. uh see we are definitely progressing yeah. towards uh, the so called equality but like she always says that we are not there yet mm. we are still on route you know mm-hmm. and we are still in the journey on that road so it's going to take a long time for us to be uh, balancing this act but the thing is for me it's really not about though i am a feminist but i do not have this at the back of my mind all the time ki 
men this and women this and women have to go. And see, we are all part of the same world. It's such a relief that at least we are not being pushed and suppressed and, you know, we are by our husbands or by our dads or, you know, our families, friends. At least we are given that equality. We have a voice and that itself is a big thing for me. Sure. Uh, how do you see this whole shift? I again see it a little nicely and then a little differently. Okay. One, like when the changes started to happen and more women were seen on the set. So like you said, no, again, styling is happening. Uh, though I must say, Neeta was with me, I think, throughout my yeah. career. <laughs> Neeta Lulla. But uh, apart from that, like your makeup person, the hair person, now they all started becoming women. My big moment was when I saw a crane going up at the shoot. And over there, sitting up there on the crane was not normally a yes. man. Uh, behind the camera, it was a woman, mm. a, a young 30 year old or something. Oh, nice. I was like, wow, and we have arrived. That's right. so nice. You know, yeah. Yeah. Uh, what I was. <laughs> <laughs> this was this part. Um, I'm sorry. So you yeah. said that it was you were thinking nicely and differently. Yeah. Haan, differently, kya tha? Mm. So, but, but then uh, maybe it'll come to you. So, but yeah. like she was saying that the comfort level, like how she felt comfortable to talk to me, even even say, for example, now I remember a scene with Soha. Mm. Uh, she's, you know, at show, like, you know, her, uh, basically I wanted her husband to come, uh, the husband character to come and lie on her. And I, for me, it was just very simple. I just did it. Yeah. You know, yeah. and she had no issue. And I, of course, you know, of course, there's no line that I will cross, but I knew that I, I'm doing it with great sure. respect. Sure. So just sat on top of her, <laughs> and you know. Uh, so I think that that uh, suddenly, and also then the person who was playing husband, even he felt at home, you know. And so there's a mutual respect uh, between people, and I do think honestly that comes from the the, the heart of a woman, that sure. that grace, you know, of of of, of uh, giving others their due. Correct. It's, it changes the whole vibe. Right. Look. Uh, there are a certain cuss words also used uh, in, <laughs> in, the, in the show. Yes. Uh, obviously, it goes with the with the climate and with with the you know text in the in the scripting of the show. Uh, was that uh, was that something like a, a deal breaker for you, or or probably you know for you also because uh, that's something that we didn't see you all doing back uh, in the times. Was that like a deal breaker? So I don't think it's very progressive to be. Uh, I, I, don't, I don't take it as a sign of progress that we have swear words used. Mm. If the character needed to say something and it is in that zone, maybe it's fine. But sure. I wouldn't say that this is a sign of progress. Uh, yeah, no, not really. I and I'm not very, no, uh, myself, I'm not comfortable <laughs> sometimes. And, right. yeah. Yeah, yeah, of course, I'm not comfortable. Um, and, um, no, but he's saying that would that have been a deal breaker? Yeah. I guess they did it, so it's not a yeah, deal breaker. Yeah, no, 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 no. We did it because yeah. we were not we. We were the character. Sure. And the character yeah. requires something and you're convinced. So, you know, once you you are on set and you've done everything, then you cannot escape and give reasons. Uh, either you take it in the beginning, take the show, take the project or don't take it. And if listen, you have they were very clear that it's not done for the sake of some sensation. Okay. Yeah, yeah, you know? yeah. Because that's just me, that's not my style at no, all. No. So, it, you know, if, if at all they have to do that, it's because it's correct for that person to say it like that at that point. Mm. Also, she does things very aesthetically and then, you know, you, you have to have that confidence in your director. Right. And we are working with her because we have that confidence in her that she and she... We, since I've seen so much of her work, read about her, know about her, even though we didn't meet ever. But there are certain people you like, you like to read about them, you like to see and the aesthetical part that she has, you know, the way she has done things. I, I think uh, as an actor, it's our duty to actually support her and the project. Sure. Uh, I want to ask you this, you know, it's, it's been what, 24 years since Dushman released? Yes. It was a Indeed. thriller, thriller <laughs> at that time. This is again a thriller. Uh, this I would say is a crime drama. Crime drama? Mm. Okay. But you know, have things become easier to kind of tell the storytelling that you want to do to kind of come out with stories because, uh, you know, I don't want to pit it as like a female centric series because, you know, actors are actors. They are female or actors. Exactly. You know, it, it is 
it has has to be both of them are nodding i would pitch it as a female centric okay. <laughs> series okay <laughs> this is the okay. thing i do this is the thing so, i love to do okay. and this is the thing i uh, most uh, you know pointedly want to put out there <laughs> <laughs> that, that that this, this i was only nodding at the actors or actors wala part of course they are of course they are <laughs> that was the only thing i said okay yeah yeah, yeah i agree <laughs> so yeah so no uh, it 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 The female stories are more welcome now right. than they were 24 years ago. Uh, there's funding for it. Mm. There's uh, enthusiasm. Uh, there are wonderful actors like them who are out, who are up for it. You know, they want to do it. Uh, there are writers who are now uh, being, you know, uh, absolute. But the writers are the busiest lot today, which is an amazing <laughs> thing. You know, not so 10 years ago at all. So I think that yes, uh, but I do think that there's still a long road ahead, uh, and and that's what. would be completely fulfilling if we arrive at the time when uh, half the content is female led show i always wonder one thing since we talk about you know women as a woman i love to see work, good work whether you know it's a male actor doing it i love to see what women are doing i love to watch women does that happen with men too do they really love watching women centric stop mm-hmm. good question good because question. ott apparently the viewership is more male yeah huh? oh. yeah so, so i'm sure oh. i mean the way i would i love watching the male uh, dominant things but i i it supersedes you know when i watch uh, a woman centric thing i know how it goes with the men mm. lastly i'd like mm. to ask the two of you all uh, you know both of us are having a release with hash hash <laughs> we also have madhuri ji having a release with majama If we skip the few years in between, nothing has changed, right? We are still having our <laughs> '90s superstars out here dominating and coming. Woo! What do you have to say nice. about it? Nice. <laughs> Amazing. <laughs> I <think> Coincidence. <laughs> I think it's God's grace, and I think we're fortunate. That fortunate it's also and because you guys want yeah. us to come. No, I mean people want to see us. Uh, directors like her want that you know we should uh, work and Ravina and so many actually from yeah. that time are mm-hmm. doing such good work. So we are thankful. Very thankful. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Thank you so much for the lovely conversation. <laughs> okay. Thank you. Thank you.